Hey cuties, Peachy here, welcome back to a new video and in this video we have a ton of Barbie movie doll tea to talk about so let's get into it. So recently we got a ton of new Barbie movie doll leaks and sightings all across the globe from Thailand first and then the Philippines and then also in Australia, big W. And in all of these stores where they were, you know, stocked early on shelves, they were not able to be purchased because uh, even though they were on shelves, the street date is actually on June 1st, which is first day this week. And so even though they were on shelves, you know, uh, the employees were not supposed to put them on shelves out early, but at least even though they if even though they are, you know, on shelves, they did not sell the dolls because that, that would have been a really big no no from um, you know, the 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 the, the shops because obviously Mattel gave them a release date embargo like it's you know you're not supposed to stock them until june 1st <laughs> but again i don't know why it's sometimes these employees they just they just put out new dolls on shelves way too early and it's like it just complicates everything a lot but anyways we got our first look at four brand new barbie movie dolls and i guess a fifth one too and also a car um <laughs> but it's a really a small sneak peek that we get to see of a new doll on the car convertible uh corvette car uh, play set we'll get into that later but so we have four full-on new barbie doll uh barbie movie dolls we have the Issa Rae barbie president doll we have the Simu Leo Ken doll. We have the Barbie Mar Margot Robbie Barbie disco doll in a gold jumpsuit. And then we also have Margot Robbie's Barbie in her Western outfit. So those are the four, four brand new dolls that we've gotten to see. And then also, obviously, they've also uh, stocked the perfect day Ryan Gosling Ken doll in his, uh, you know, swim trunks looking really cute. Uh, and we've seen that doll already leak uh, a while ago. So it is not that's not new but still cool uh that they're really getting more you know sighted frequently and also like in australia that's the most recent sighting place uh for the ryan gosling doll uh again they were not able to be purchased uh but they were just i don't know why but just it's like a collective thing happening that these stores are just putting out these dolls early for people to find but then you can't even buy them so it's just it's like really weird <laughs> But let's get into uh, each new doll uh, into all the tea because they're so detailed and there's so much to talk about. So let's get into each doll now. So the first doll here we're going to take a look at is the Dance the Night Margot Robbie Barbie doll. Again, in the gold jumpsuit with all of the sequins stitched on. Now she looks gorgeous. I love the little headpiece that she's wearing. Um, I'm not sure if that's fabric or plastic or like how it's attached but it looks really cute nonetheless it really looks accurate to what the headpiece looks on in the movie and the trailer shots that we got to see um the hair is wavy it's a nice it has a nice shape it's gelled obviously um the earrings look really accurate as well her face up seems to be the same exact one that we got in the perfect perfect day barbie margot robbie barbie doll as well um no the makeup is the same as well like the pink lips not not much of an eyeshadow surprisingly i wish she had some like perhaps some gold eyeshadow to complement her outfit but i guess not it's simple but still really cute i like the bracelets as well and then uh, she does come with a doll stand too uh the base is white and the um the stand is actually the the actual stand is translucent the bases do change color between dolls if they do have stands which not even all of them do come with doll stands which is so random like the the perfect day barbie doll that you know in the pink plaid dress that people have been already found finding early on ebay uh there's reviews of her on here on youtube uh she doesn't come with a doll stand so it's weird that she doesn't come with one and the perfect day ken doll also doesn't come with one but as far as i can see all of these dolls here come with a with a doll stand so it's really random but anyways these all all of these dolls also cost the same around 40 something uh, dollars or you know in their respective currencies where they were found so it seems that they're also going to be they're also going to be more expensive and maybe that's why they have a doll stand but then we'll get, as we get to the president barbie doll she also has a different advantage and she costs the same so it's really random but so yeah the um dance night disco barbie doll here i like her golden jumpsuit i think the flared pants is really cute uh we don't actually get to see 
the full outfit because obviously these are really close-up pictures um but i think she looks really cool i i think the box is really simple but it looks like a really nice vintage barbie box i like the vibe um and also by the way all these pictures are from facebook from this um from this uh group group uh that's all about you know barbie it's called barbie collector uh collectors plus 18 that's that's literally how they're called and i joined just to get these pictures <laughs> and i'm not even showing them here because i'm scared to death that mattel is gonna hate me if i show anything here that's not i'm not supposed to so that's why uh just check out my instagram link down below for the all the pictures um but basically you've seen the thumbnail that's what they look like but <laughs> yeah i think it's 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 uh, so all these pictures are from you know credits to the respective owners and to you know so from the group group chat i guess facebook group i don't know what to call it <laughs> i don't i don't use facebook ever as you can tell but um I, yeah so i think she looks good uh i think she's very simple like i get that she's uh, accurate to the movie like it's just a golden jump jumpsuit and that, that's it but um she really feels simple and you're paying a lot of money so it's just it kind of doesn't really add up you then know then we have the simu liu ken doll that's also wearing the you know he, he's also from the same scene here he's right next to barbie here uh and he's also wearing a disco inspired little outfit now the I, there's no really there's no good picture that i could find of him in this outfit in the trailer so we're gonna have to zoom in and on these blurry pictures of him but basically um there's one really good close-up of ryan gosling's ken so we're gonna just also just pretend that simu leo because the jump I, I do think the outfit is the same but i don't know why ken has a golden belt and for simu leo's ken outfit he does not so the outfit's much more simpler but basically it's just a white jumpsuit um it seems to be all one piece but it i do think it's actually separate like the jacket is one portion one piece and then the pants are one piece and the jacket has a working zipper. I, I know you can't see it, but it's a huge chunky zipper in white. And if you know doll zippers, it's that it it looks exactly like how you think it looks. Um, and it works. Obviously, that it's a functioning zipper. It's amazing. I love it. It looks it's really chunky and big, but I feel like it just works. Um, the we have the golden K as well on the one side on the torso. The sleeves are gold with some you know white cuffs. Um, or you know like little uh at the ends are like white and then the pants are all white and then it seems to have some pockets as well some like gold details on the sides of the pants um pant legs so i think the outfit is uh very simple again but here there's so much detail with the zipper the k the different uh, materials used for the you know sleeves and the gold details and then of course the simu liu face here also looks really good um it looks kind of like the actor simu liu but it also just works as a generic barbie face so i feel like it looks really good the hair is gelled but looks really good as well and for him he also comes with a base a doll stand but the base here is in gold which is so random because barbie's base and she's from the same scene here um barbie's base is in white and then here his uh simu Liu's ken doll here the base is in gold but i guess it makes sense because his outfit is majorly white and the accents are gold and then for barbie you know her outfit is all gold and then i guess her base is just white so it kind of works actually so it's, it's a really fun detail but i i think he looks amazing i love that we're getting a simu liu simu liu ken doll i didn't think they would do that honestly um but i'm really glad they did it really shows that they are going to create dolls of probably more characters than we than we're artistic and then then we are anticipating right now because i initially thought that maybe we were, we were only going to get to see dolls of like ryan gosling Margot robbie um do a leap up hope hopefully uh kate mckinnon obviously and maybe like one more two more characters you know gloria um as well we know confirmed um who's played by america ferrera she's the human character but i didn't i couldn't foresee that they were also going to create a doll of simu leo so to me that opens the doors to a lot of more characters from this from this movie also getting a doll hopefully so that's really then exciting then we have the Issa ray barbie doll who's the president in the movie and her doll has a made to movie 
uh, body and she's also around the same price which is there's still again it doesn't add up because you're apparently paying the same price like with the other dolls we just saw but here she has a made to move body now we do know that she does probably have a made to move body because she is labeled as a collector doll on her listing as we saw recently in the last video where we talked about the barbie movie dolls um so maybe that's why she i mean that's def that's definitely why she has a made to move body because she's again she's a collector doll but then why she's then why is she the same price like the other dolls i would think she's at least going to be more expensive if she if she's going to be a collector doll and also have a made to move body so i don't know maybe that's also going to change the pricing is going to change i'm not sure but what i do know is that she's definitely the only doll we've seen so far from the barbie movie line um to have a made to move body which is very fascinating uh so she looks amazing i think the outfit is super accurate to the movie um we get to see Issa Rae's Barbie, uh, President Barbie, uh, like in one scene with this outfit. So we don't have much of a good look at this outfit specifically. But what we do see is a very good uh, match to the doll and what she's wearing. We have the sash, the gold tassel on one side. We have the dress that's off the sleeve shoulders. We have the gold details, like like flowery details, like kind of like drooling down. Um, we have the pink kind of like light, light baby pink uh, mesh tool of the dress, the huge chunky gold necklace, the earrings. Um, and uh, and she, 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 she's even wearing some pink nail polish. So that looks really cool as well. <laughs> I think she looks amazing now does she look like Issa Rae the actress no I don't think so necessarily I think this face up once again it works really well as a generic Barbie face mold but also it it kind of looks like Issa Rae I guess a little bit like if you really wanted to make it look like her like if you want to believe it's her you can definitely see her in this face mold but it's definitely not um you know constricted to her face like this is definitely a very generic barbie face so but it's a new face mold so that's also very exciting so the hair is very basic it's like very cold uh very 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 what cold <laughs> it's, it's very uh curled i mean <laughs> very curled very bouncy very gelled obviously um and her, her makeup's very simple, very natural. So I think she's very, very cute. And she also includes a doll stand. I'm not sure what the base color of the, the stand is, but I'm assuming it's white or gold or pink uh, or black. It's re she's really cute. I like her a lot. And then lastly, we have our first look at the, probably like the most popular Barbie doll from this collection. It's the Western, Western Star Barbie doll. She's wearing the Western outfit that we saw in the trailer, the, you know, that has the pink, uh, two-piece with the pants having like this really nice flare at the bottom this outfit is so iconic honestly like it's just i love it so much and i i love the doll already like i love the hat it's uh plastic i think um yeah it's plastic for sure it ha it does have like a nice sticker or something like painted or maybe it's like an actual ribbon like attached to the um you know inside of the hat it looks really cool um you can see like little uh gemstones also like uh printed on the ribbon i'm guessing so it looks really nice and then the face up is the same for the you know the margot robbie face it looks the same the same makeup everything the hair is also kind of like the same like the other barbie we saw the gold jumpsuit barbie it's very curled very gelled very much the same length uh, she has some nice earrings on star shaped um she has the uh what do you call it the um the ascot i f i believe is what you call it uh, around her neck it's tied around her neck it's super cute uh it has a lot of details um printed on which is amazing um and then the the top piece is um i'm not sure I've gu i'm guessing it removes uh, it opens up on the back via velcro but it's very fitted i like the way it's shaped it looks very tailored and it does look very much like the um the, the actual outfit in the movie and then the pants to me for me are the best part which obviously the flared pants with these stars um little motifs uh on top it looks so amazing i love it so much and she she does not have a doll stand so that's very interesting and i think she's going to be one of the more popular dolls from this barbie movie doll collection because i mean she just looks amazing and the outfit is definitely very accurate to the movie so um 
she looks amazing. I cannot wait to get her. She's going to be a bestseller for sure. Uh, or a correction, she does come with a doll stand. I just saw it's a white base. So that's very cool. But very simple. It matches her hat perfectly. So I do think the top maybe could be a little bit more fitted at the bottom. It does seem a little baggy, but I also think that just could be a, 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 a diverse little, um, you know, perhaps like a default that happens with every doll individually but anyways um she looks amazing she's perfect to me she's my favorite so far overall as i mentioned before we did also get to see the new uh car a cor corvette play set in a store leak as well it's a just the box picture of the car it looks like the car that we actually got to see in the um dua lipa music video i believe that's actually the same car exactly so it's really cool that we got that we got a little sneak peek of the car the actual music video that's a, that's a very cool little easter egg because i wasn't even even sure if that was an actual if there was the actual car or just like a prop but it does seem to be the actual car so it's like a really nice little hidden easter egg and on the packaging for this playset we can see a another uh, margot robbie barbie doll but this time she's in a brand new outfit that we haven't seen in the trailers or leaked so far in the doll version so it's a really cute little you know uh like a like it seems to be like a matching two piece like the jacket that has like a pink a light a very light pink and almost like minty looking like stripe motif um and then a matching hat as well it looks so cute it's very like cute preppy looking i'm not sure which doll this is going to be labeled as because we also again we haven't seen this outfit up here in a trailer so i'm assuming this is going to be maybe the um return to barbie land outfit that we also got a listing for so this this could be it and we also actually got to see um a peek at uh this outfit in the trailer on, on the reflection of uh, ken's sunglasses here it's very hard to make out but you can kind of see the reflection of the you know of margot robbie wearing this outfit that she's wearing here on the doll and on the packaging so she looks really cool it's again a very bad first image of the outfit but you can kind of make out what the outfit is supposed to look like i like the hat I like the colors um and also and then also we actually get to see her the back of her with the hat a better look at the hat and also the jacket and she looks amazing so i definitely think this might be maybe part of the, the finale look um whatever it is it looks amazing so and the actual outfit that ken's wearing in this shot also is going to be part of a new doll it's labeled as the ken collector doll in fur coat so i'm assuming that this doll is going to be based on the outfit that we see here with the fur coat the bandana and the sunglasses so very interesting i definitely want to see the context here and also just the situation and also just the story be behind this outfit because it looks very rad but also like very I, I bet you it's going to have more meaning than we think it does and those are all the leaks we have so far again the street date is set for june 1st for the dolls to be able to be purchased if you live in one of those sited locations again thailand philippines and australia at big w stores then perhaps you know try your luck and go to one of these stores uh and maybe you will be able to buy one of these dolls early because i don't know when they're supposed to be released like properly worldwide or in the u.s like um so i we don't even we don't even have stock photos that's the thing we don't they had they haven't even really released stock photos or listings for these dolls so it's pretty much still a mystery so i do hope that mattel will release proper information uh by the end of this week or maybe next week or by the middle of june because again the movie is coming out in july 21st so i don't i don't think they can wait for much longer but um yeah so far i'm very hyped and very excited for the movie and for these dolls i'm I'm definitely gonna go bankrupt <laughs> that was the video i hope y'all enjoyed let me know what you think down below leave a like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell and become a member today so you don't miss out when i post more content like this coming at your way daily and keeping you up to date with all the dolls you love stay safe be kind i hope to see you next time stay peachy kisses